we got some F1 liveries to show. Finally, something new in the, well, not finally, the, uh, AFX has been really coming out with some stuff lately. This has been my biggest gripe with AFX is not enough new stuff. But man, this year they really, it's like they've heard my complaints or something. I don't know. I don't know why they would listen to me anyway. I'm really nobody in sock cars. However, <laughs> we got these for the show. They sent us in. Um, we got to take care of our pre-orders first, obviously. This was our original order. He just uh, uh, expedited it a little bit for us so we could we would have some in time for the show. Um, I'm just going to keep the camera here for one second and uh, make sure we're live real quick. Hello? Should I not be going live? Is that okay? I know Ryan might not be okay with me showing these off yet. Am, am I not? Am I not? I was gonna pack them up. Like just this instant. Yeah. Why? Well, you wanna check it? Cause nobody's there yet. We kept screaming. Well, I'm not gonna. I can't say it right now because I'm on the live stream. What do you do? I told you this in text, but no, I'm showing off these new, um, these new cards. I want to open one, but I feel like we're going to sell out of them. So I'm not going to open one, but I want to. We need to get some more on the order, I think. Um, yeah, okay, we got seven people here. We're just waiting for people to file in. We're showing off the new AF1 cars. Uh, I'm just getting some stuff around because I'm going to start shipping our pre-orders. Um, we have a couple set aside for the for the show this weekend, and uh, yeah. So when we're at the show, we're going to have to take them out of inventory as we sell them now. Did you hear me? Oh no, I got the I got the phone done yet. We're technically closed. Alright, let me let you go. Come now. from Akron OH. Hello, Fruit Finger Toys. How can I help you today? Oh my god, Adam, I we're close you know I'm not 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 even obliged to answer the phone call when it's after five. What what do you think um what do you think the channel says? What does the what does my title say? What, that's why we have them as we're bringing them to the show. But if if we sell out though, um, you're gonna have to wait for the next batch. Yeah, that's yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You can have what you want. Adam's just going to buy us out anyway. Oh, are you? Yeah, I'm not saying anything, but I might be saying something. But, like, if I were saying something, I might be saying something about August. 
if I was saying something, but I'm not saying anything. Okay, good. But like if I were saying something. Yeah, and that's a little bit exciting, isn't it? But there's still nothing, nothing set in stone yet, and it's still very liquid. No, you wait till I get there. After thir after this weekend, you can sell whatever you want. But you gotta wait till I get there. Yeah, I want to check it out. As long as I guess as long as your walls are good, I, I want to see the full ambiance. I, I, I don't care about stuff you have tucked away. We got to find a way to find some time to get to your house. Adam has his live stream, not no more. I know, I, I didn't realize you, I, I really don't follow any live streams, so. Um, but I don't have a mug from you, so it's hard to. All right, we got about twelve people. Should we sh should we start sharing sharing these uh these F one cards? These are awesome too. Well, the last ones were awesome. I'm surprised we even still have any more. These are these are great. I'm raising the price soon. I I got to talk to Ryan when I can raise raise the price back to. But these are the old ones. Well, not old ones. These just came out too. They're coming. AFX is actually coming out with some good stuff. What do you mean you don't like the yellow tab? Oh, did ya? Oh, wow. I would hold on. I would hold on to it till they're they're out of production before you start selling them. Well, they are out of production. It was a it was a three thousand print run, I think. Aren't these aren't these limited? Yeah, these are limited to three thousand print runs. Do you want me to get a pre-order put together for you? Oh, we don't know prices yet, though. So I guess we can't do that. Yeah, yeah, we can do that. All right, I think I got to start. I got to start pe showing people this stuff. Otherwise, they're going to be like, what's going on here? He's just talking on the phone. <laughs> All right, we'll see ya. All right, this is the moment. Okay, so as we know, these just came out not too long ago. 22084, these are on our website. They are the last ones. Beautiful, beautiful livery. The the cars also run better. I think they, um, I think they tight. Now, I don't know this for sure. This is just hearsay for whatever, but they seem to run and their tolerances seem to be tighter than in the past. It seems like, I think they did a, um, I think after that latest warranty issue they had where where all those where they had all those problems and um uh with the paint job with the white car that white mustang I think they really really buckled down on them on the Chinese. I don't know that for sure. However, they seem to run much better than their previous cars. Not that there were huge uh, issues with AFX, but there were some issues with some tolerances. And it seems like they've tightened up with their tolerances with these latest runs. So um, these Alfa Romero cars run really smooth. And that's I, I've heard this from other people, not just my own experience. And that's why I'm sharing it. If it was just me kind of like, oh, these seem to run better, I wouldn't just said anything. But I, I've heard it from multiple people that they seem to have tightened up their tolerances. Um, however, if you collect AFX, you probably just have them anyway. Uh, okay, so 2208. Zero. These are available for pre-order, which we have them, so they're no longer available for pre-order. They're now just in new arrivals. I have to change that around. Um, but if you do order them tonight, you will. They will ship tomorrow. Even if you pre-order them, it will do it like you're pre-ordering it. But I will get that changed within the hour. 
Let's go ahead and check these out. I'm just so excited to finally open something new because it's been so long. Um, aside from the other AFX stuff, uh, yeah, I we were wait, we were hoping to have the uh, you know our new uh, three pack exclusive or not three pack but new three series exclusives the the like runoff ones the the ones where they're just trying to get uh, their numbers increased for the end of the year or whatever um, with the Dick Landy car and all that uh, and the Biff car. We don't have them yet. They're stuck at a security checkpoint in China for who knows how long. But that will be another three weeks at least on those. So I finally get to open something new, and that's what I've been waiting for. Wait, look at that. Look at that. Isn't that... Really, I'm just trying to get one out. I don't want them all out. Okay, I'll take two out. Okay, two two zero eight zero Alfa Romero F1 Monza 2023. I want to open one, but I, I think we're going to sell out, so I don't think I'm going to, I don't think I'm able to open one yet. I wish there was less. Maybe if I turn it to the side, there'll be less glare. Yeah, there's less glare over here. Wow, that one's... This is the one we've sold a little bit more of. Most people just bought both of them, but there were a couple of people who bought just this one. I can't open it yet, not until after the show. That, 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 that was the main reason we got them so early, was because we're supposed to bring them to the show. It's under the... Hey, James Murray, it's under the pre-order section. I'll move them to new arrivals right now. That's what we'll do. Right now, I'm going to move them to, uh, to new arrivals. I don't want to just stare at my chest, though. So. Not that staring at my face is much better, but... <laughs> I'll show the other one in just one second. I gotta get, I'm gonna move these over to new arrivals. It takes just a quick second. We're kind of still waiting for people to filter in. Adam, hold, do a hold on your live just for, um, for 20 minutes. Do a 20 minute hold on your live. And I do not support his channel, by the way. Not until I see a mug. Pro Tinker has a mug. <coughs> we have a beautiful mug. It's a nice large mug. It's a beautiful mug. What is he doing? Wait a second. I gotta delete that. Can I delete it? I don't think I can. What happened to my mug that I had there? What mug did you have here? The Pro Tinker mug? I, Mac probably moved it. I don't know. Mac, Mac moves everything. Oh, 
is it this one? The a AFX Yeti? Is that what you're talking about? It's not really a mug, it's a can. Are you talking about the actual Pro Tinker Toys one? It, it, it's just been, it's been used, so it's been cleaned and put back in the shelf. But I, I think it's a good mug. It's a nice large mug. It's not like one of those massive mugs. It's the perfect size if you like just a little bit, because a standard mug's probably like this big. This is a good size mug. So if Adam, if you ever do decide to become like an official channel and get yourself a mug, you want this size mug. But I think, yeah, this is the size mug you want. Okay, eight, three, eight, one, eight, one, eight, zero. Let me make sure that changes took effect. And then at the front page should be And I'm I'm gonna keep the price for another day of the pre ordered price. Uh, well price day it's at least gonna stay the rest of the day. I don't I'll I gotta talk to Ryan when that gets changed. Because it wasn't supposed to come till Sunday. But um, since it is here, the pre-order special is over. So, I don't know. We'll give you guys an extra day or two on that, on the special price. Because when you guys pre-order stuff, it helps us know how much we need to order. And, it, and then we're not sitting on so much product. And we, we can kind of order just enough and then uh, however much we want to sit on rather than just ordering a lot. Um, and then sitting on a lot of inventory. So pre-orders really help us out. That's why we give you guys a special deal on people who do a pre-order. What's the red x-ray? It's a thumbs up. It's like stuck there, but it's a thumb, it's a, it's, it's a literal hand. You guys are in mind there, there, Arbuckle. Okay, cool. All four cars are on the new newly arrived. The the two new ones are gonna be stuck at the uh, the special pre order pricing just uh, probably until the end of the day. Um, and uh, yeah, I'll I'll leave it to the end of the day. Okay, so the first car. We already kind of showed it off, but a couple other people have came in, so let's let's go ahead and show it again. This is two two zero eight zero Alpha Romero F one Romeo, not Romero. That's my wife's last name. Well, it was uh, Alpha Romeo F one Monza twenty twenty three. Has like a little. Yeah, so that's all the stuff. Has a nice little picture back there. This is the number this one is. And then the packaging. Limited edition. 5,000 limited run. It's not a three. Okay, I thought it was 3,000. So 5,000, my bad. 5,000 limited run. Oh, shoot. You want to get over here so there's not as much glare. Unless I do it. Yeah, if I do it over there, there will be a lot of glare. Okay. I'm 
trying to keep the glare down. The animal takes too far away. Okay, what if, does the soft box help? Now not letting enough light in. Yeah, I think it's better with the glare. Boy, that thing is very cool. I love the um the paint job on this one. It's not just black and red. And like, like I was saying earlier, I've heard reports that these run even better than previous releases. Oh, and then this is kind of cool. Uh, so the wing is like a carbon fiber looking thing. <laughs> Everybody. Very cool. Okay, so for the, the second new release, we have, and this one's cool because it has a lot of green in it. It's 22081. It's weird that they have that photo. They have the same photo. I wonder if that's a mistake. Oh, they have that photo in all of them. That's interesting. They have the photo. That, that should have been an indication that they were going to make this car. Because even the first ones have that photo on the back of it. Very interesting. Okay, so 22081. Alfa Romeo F1 Spa 2023. And this is this one. Let's get some good... Very cool. I think they're just beautiful looking cars. Look at those wheels. That is one thing AFX knows how to do is really, really put some detail on these little cars. And same thing they have that, is that on all of them? The back? Oh, I guess the back's like that on all. I didn't realize that on those other ones. But the eye, I didn't realize the under wing was painted. That's a nice detail. Very cool. So we'll just do a quick review of all the all the new releases. These are all new arrivals on ProTinkerToys.com on the uh, front page. It's just just click if you're somewhere else, just click the the Pro Tinker at top and go to the home page and it'll be just arrived and you'll see all the new arrivals of these four. So we have uh the older ones are actually the newer numbers, but it's 22083 is the older one. This is the Alfa Romeo F1 FY77 2023. This is the 20 or 22084 Alfa Romeo F1 
FY24, 2023. They just said they set so low. And then 22080, this one just arrived today. Uh, in time for the show that we're going we're gonna to be bringing these to Cleveland. Very cool. And then the 22081 Alfa Romero F1 Spa 2023. Very cool. All right, guys, I just wanted to give you guys a quick update. Um, and I was super excited to open something new. So this is sweet. We finally got the F1 cars. And uh, as you can see, I've already started getting the pre-orders ready to ship out. And we're going to get them out. And uh, that's a wrap. You guys all have a good one. And I'm just catching up on. All right, you guys have a good one. I don't know how to exit out of here.